Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. And also with you. When we were baptized in Christ Jesus, we were baptized into his death. We were buried with him through baptism so that, as Christ was raised from the dead by the glory of the Father, we too might walk in newness of life. For if we have been united with him in a death like this, we shall certainly be united with him in a resurrection like this. Let us pray. Almighty God, those who die in the Lord still live with you in joy and blessedness. We give thanks for the grace you have bestowed upon your saints who have finished their course in faith and now rest from their labors. This morning we name them before you as we light a candle and sound a bell as a symbol of their everlasting life in you. I would remind you as each name is read, if you are a family member or close friend of that individual, please honor them by standing when that name is read. And then also a reminder that following the service this morning, um, for members of the church, the candles, their names are on the candles. Um, so if you would come forward, you are very welcome to take that candle home with you. If you have any difficulty getting up to the altar, I'm going to ask Pastor Monica if she would be willing to be here at the front following worship, and she can help you get the candle up your loved one. Sue Andrews. Shirley Edwards. Harrison Flint. Cheryl Harner. Mary Twitty. Father of Lynn Gupto, Winthrop Gupto. I'm 
invite you to turn to your program as we prepare to celebrate 